Hi, today we're going to do another word problem on ratio. Let's read the question. The ratio of the number of red apples to the number of green apples in a box was 3 is to 5. Mr. Lim put 35 more red apples into the box and the ratio of red apples to green apples became 5 is to 6. A. How many green apples were there in the box? B. What was the total number of apples in the box at first? Okay, let's see what we can gather from the question. Now, I'm given a ratio 3 is to 5, and that is the number of red apples to the number of green apples. And then I was told that 35 more red apples were added into the box. Mm -hmm. So with that increase in the number of red apples, there is a new ratio. Okay, And that ratio is red apples to green apples became 5 is to 6. And the question is asking me to find the number of green apples in the box as well as the total number of apples in the box at first okay so let's see what i've gathered from the question i'm given a ratio okay which is red apples to green apples which is three is to five Okay, later on, Mr. Lim actually put in another 35 red apples. And, okay, so I know that after adding 35 red apples, the new ratio is 5 is to 6. Okay, now let's see. Looking at this question, there is an increase in the number of red apples. However, the number of green apples remain unchanged. Because he didn't add any green apples. So with that, we can actually try to solve the question with that clue. Now, some of you may have this mistaken that this ratio 3 is to 5 and a new ratio 5 is to 6 and therefore there's an increase in the number of red apples and there's an increase in the number of green apples because if we were to compare oh this is 3 to 5 and this is 5 to 6 now that is a wrong concept because there is an increase in the number of red apples in the end due to adding 35 red apples so when we compare the new number of red apples, therefore, there is a new ratio form, which is 5 is to 6. It does not mean that the number of green apples has increased. Alright? Okay, so knowing that the green apples is constant, which means unchanged, therefore, I'm going to make the ratio, the green apples portion, to be the same which is now I have 5 in the ratio 3 is to 5 for green apples and here 6 for the green apples in the ratio 5 is to 6 I'm gonna make this two number to be the same since green apples is unchanged so in order to do that to make 5 and 6 to be the same number I have to find the same common multiples, which is 30. Because 30 is common, uh, is a multiple of 5 and common is a multiple of 6 and they both share 30. So therefore, looking at that, alright, red is to green apples. So we have at first, which is 3 is to 5. And then later on, we have the uh, n which is 
five is the six. Okay, as I said, I'm gonna make this green part, the green apples, to be the same since it's constant, it did not change. In order to do that, I'm going to multiply by six so that my new ratio for at first will be three times six, 18, and five times six, 30. And over here to make six to be 30, I multiply by five, okay? So that will give me five times five, 25, and six times five, 30. So what I'm doing here is I'm trying to make the green apples to be the same number in both ratio. Since I know that the number of green apples remain unchanged because Mr. Lim only puts 35 more red apples, not any green apples. Okay, so with that, Therefore, I can now compare the number of units for my red apples. Which is in the end, after adding 35 more red apples, I have 25 units. But at first, I have 18 units. Therefore, I can say that 25 units minus away 18 units, which will give me 7 units. And therefore, this 7 units is actually the 35 more red apples that were added by Mr. Lim. So one unit is 35 divided by 7, that is 5. Mm -hmm. So with one unit which is 5, I'm able to find the number of green apples. So the number of green apples is 30 unit, which will be 30 times 5. And that will be 150. So my answer for A is 150 green apples. Okay, so that answers my first question. How many green apples were there in the box? 150. Now the second part, what was the total number of apples in the box at first? Now be very mindful that I'm looking at at first. So in this case, I should be looking at this ratio, 18 is to 30, not 25 is to 30. So, at first, my total units will be 18 units plus 30 units, which is the number of red apples and the number of green apples. That will give me 48 units. Now, if I know that one unit is 5, I'm able to find 48 units. So 48 units will be 48 times 5. And that will give me 240. So my answer for part B, the total number of apples in the box at first will be 240 apples.